so the ever so question, what is better? Is it a lease or is it a rental? Uh, some of these bad boys could be so expensive, like $900 a week plus the mileage. Aye, aye, aye. Could be very problematic depending, mm -hmm. like now your business is restricted operationally mm -hmm. on how many miles you can do a, a, a week before you break the bank. So if it's like, even if it's 15 cents a mile, imagine that, uh, you know, the average out there right now, 220 a mile, something like mm -hmm. that. And yep. right off the bat, that's going to go to these guys. Man, that could be problematic. So there's a better option, right? Our guys use Lone Mountain. The reason they like that is because you're going to get a monthly payment right to them. It is your truck. No one is forcing you to do anything. It is not a rental. You can move the truck around as you wish as a true independent contractor. And at the end of the day, 1600 uh, 1600 a month. Some of these guys are 1495. It is all reachable. It is feasible. You can actually survive as an owner operator. So I don't know. That's just us dropping good information. Uh, always shop around before you make a decision for those who are buying. You'll hear a lot of stories out there, but remember, you got to do what works for you and what you have capacity to reach. Is it always better to walk into a dealer? Yes, it is. Does everybody have the ability to do that? No, they don't. So you got to find your way, your path. But point is, you got to do something and make it happen. All right, guys, please drive safe. We hope to see you soon.